Okay, so we made that um, veggie broth um, from scraps that we collected and put in the freezer over a couple of weeks. And when you have veggie broth in the freezer, it's really easy just to whip up a, a really healthy dinner. So what I do sometimes when I'm that lazy, I'll just grab some veggie stock from the freezer, put it straight in there, frozen and all, and then I'll literally just get some veggies and just cut them in. You don't have to make any space. You don't have to say, you know, if you're living in a share house, hey guys, can I use the fucking whole counter or whatever? You can just literally stand over a pot and cut shit into it. And then, what else do I want? A bit of sweet potato. Don't worry about the skin. It's really good for you. People get scared of the skin, but if there is any weird germs on there, it just gets boiled away anyway. So just seriously, just chill out about that. And what else do I want in there? Just put some like greens from the supermarket. That's really nice. Put some like protein in there. I've just got some beans. You can also put, if you've got dried pulses, if it's quick cooking like lentils, you just throw them in. You can even just chuck the beans in there with a bit of that stuff from the can, it's fine. Um, I might throw some of these tomatoes in. Tomatoes are nice, just boiled up. They always add a nice vibe to a soup. Oh, if you've got seaweed at home, um, seaweed um, and miso are really good things to have around. So I'll just chuck some seaweed in there too and it instantly just becomes this exciting Japanese soup as soon as you put seaweed in something. So just let that all boil up and then you've got yourself a really healthy dinner and it's, it hasn't taken anything. I've literally just gone zh, 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 zh. and it, you'll feel so smug like eating it. You'll just be sitting there feeling so happy and like you're the most healthy person ever.